Hello, welcome back to Kay's YouTube channel. How are we all doing today? I hope we're doing really well. Um, well, it's official. Albon is leaving Red Bull and Perez has got the seat. What is everyone's thoughts on that? I think I've seen quite a few sort of angry people saying Albon should stay at Red Bull. It's not right that he's leaving. Then you've got the flip side where they're saying, nope, he's right. Perez deserves to be in a great car, a faster car, so if to get my points, my podiums. So whose side are you on? Are you on the Albon should have stayed side? Or the Perez should have got the seat side, which Perez has. So Perez and Verstappen will both be at Red Bull next year. So I just hope it's not all max. I hope that it is 50-50, but we shall see. And then the other decision is the half seat. Should Mazipan get the seat or should it be or should it be if it was given away Albon take that seat what we think what are our thoughts should he Mazipan get the seat at Haas I personally think no I think it should go to somebody else but I think if there was a person to get the seat at Haas it would be Callum Eilat. I think he would be a perfect driver alongside Mick Schumacher. I think they would be a perfect pair. And I just think it would be great. Those two together on a track. What are your thoughts? Do you agree with me? Do you not? I can't wait for next season. The only person who hasn't officially signed is Hamilton at Mercedes. But Toto has signed on for another three years, so I wonder if that'll mean Hamilton will go for the full 10 World Championships. We shall see. It'd be very so cool if it did. Do you think? Also, here's the question that I'm going to leave you on. Do you think anyone can beat Hamilton's uh, record? Do you think there is any driver that you think over the next 10 or so years can beat Hamilton? Let me know down below. Like, share and subscribe. Thank you very much and I hope to see you soon.